One of my favorite things to do with my LEGO videos is to experiment with new techniques and new styles in order to keep my content fresh and exciting. The spaceship battle in my latest Guardians of the Galaxy video employed a lot of film techniques that I had never used before, but were a lot of fun to figure out. The elements were all shot against a green screen and composited together into the final image, sometimes multiple times. The entire Ravager fleet was simply the Milano shot from several different angles and then composited into the shot over and over again. I changed the coloring of each of the different ships in After Effects, giving each a distinct look. I used three separate methods to capture the movement of the flying ships. First, I used traditional stop motion, moving the ship in front of the camera. Second, I tried moving the camera up and down to give the illusion that the ships were moving. And third, I mounted the ships on a green base and just moved them in front of the camera with my hands. Whoever thought playing with your spaceships would actually turn into a video? This last method proved quite effective, allowing me to give their movement a fluid, organic feel without spending hours of time on the animation. More often than not, I found that this live-action movement ended up working perfectly. The notable exceptions, of course, are the shots that feature animated elements, such as the pilots moving around or the wing fins adjusting. A final touch that really gave these shots their realistic edge were layers of grain used to simulate clouds. The farther away from the camera the objects were supposed to be, the more layers of grain lay between them and the camera. This atmospheric perspective really sold the illusion of distance and also helped to cover up any sloppy compositing that my shots might have had. In the end, all of these different elements combined to create a really cool effect. Thanks very much for watching and I hope you picked up some useful tips. If you have any questions, please comment below and I will try to answer them either through a comment or through a future video. So make sure to subscribe and check back next week for another new video. Thanks guys.